I would like to present a technique for downsizing a fresh osteochondral allograft plug size 16 millimeters to 12 millimeters. From the 12 millimeter single use oats set, two supplies are needed, the 12 millimeter graft delivery tube and the 12 millimeter harvest device. From the 16 millimeter single use oats set, the 16 millimeter graft delivery tube, and lastly a mallet. So the same principle for allograft implantation of perpendicular approach to the cartilage applies to downsizing from a 16 to a 12 millimeter allograft. It's critical that we have a perpendicular harvest approach. Otherwise, we can create an oblique oriented graft. So we have our 16 millimeter allograft, and we're going to use the 16 millimeter graft delivery tube. The graft is loaded into the tube, and we place it on our hard surface. Next, we will use the 12 millimeter harvest device to downsize the 12 millimeter plug. So once loaded, we can bring in the 12 millimeter harvester. I find it's best to sit for this portion of the procedure so that you can see very well the orientation of the harvester as it approaches the cartilage. So we're now going to bring the harvester down to the articular surface. We're firmly holding it in a perpendicular fashion to the articular surface. Next, my assistant will stabilize the top portion of the harvester and then we'll use a mallet to impact the harvester through the 16 millimeter plug. Once fully impacted, which is generally 15 millimeters because that's the length of the cores that are processed, we can check the bottom portion. At this point, we've completed the downsizing and we're going to extrude the graft from the harvester. So my assistant will hold the graft as it's extruded so I can stabilize the device. So at this point, we have our 12 millimeter plug that is downsized from the 16 millimeter pre-processed fresh allograft. Once the depth of the recipient site is known, this plug can be trimmed to the appropriate length. 